Hey, boo. How are you guys? I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day today. I just want to say hello to all my new subscribers. Thank you so much for coming by and subscribing. So, in today's video, guys, I have some sneakers here for you guys. Um, Spencer had contacted me and wanted me to do a review on some shoes. Her website, she offers shoes of all kinds. You just have to go in there and look. So, you guys already know if you want the information, just email me. So, the shoes that I picked are the Louis Vuitton X Off-White X Air Jordan 1. And it says Custom Man. So, yeah, I did get these. Um, and I'll tell you why. I do wear sneakers as well. And I just thought this pair was really, really cool. And look at the box that it comes in. Well, it comes in like a little mini suitcase here. It's so cute. So let's check it out. And I want to thank Spencer again for letting me pick the shoe. So here it is. Let's take a look. This is the little mini luggage. It is so cute. Look at the front. This is the side. This is the back here. This is the other side. And this is the bottom. Well, she has tape on it, so let's take it off. You guys know it came in like a cardboard box, and I have um, took that out. And this was inside. So these are it. So these are the feet of the little mini luggage. I love this because I will probably store some of my SOGs in here. My designer SOG is so cute. Hardware is silver. And it has that um, already patina trim and everything on the mini little luggage here. So let's open it up so you can open it up like this all the way down. Let's see. All right. Let me turn it the right way. All right. So this is how it comes. Let's see. Will it stay open? It's supposed to stay open. Okay. Let's see, guys. All right, there it is. <laughs> so these are it. All right, so the thing with me is I do not buy designer sneakers, heels, or anything. So I'm going to tell you why. I do have a couple of slides, um, about three or four slides from different um, designers, like luxury um, designers. So I truly don't buy high-end shoes. I did have some red bottoms because my friend talked me into getting red bottoms, but they hurt. And at the bottom of the shoe, if you wear it, it does not remain red at the bottom. So I was thinking you pay so much money for the shoes, they will put a seal at the bottom and you're able to walk with them without them getting uh, ruined. But they don't be red anymore. And also they hurt like hell and you could get little corns on your feet. So I just really kind of stay away from like luxury um, heels and kind of shoes a little bit because you're walking on the ground, you're getting gum, and as um, gum at the bottom of the shoe or whatever would not spit. You know, people do all kinds of things on the sidewalks, you know, so I just don't buy high-end shoes. <laughs> not only that, those red bottoms, I had a family member. I could tell this story because not a lot of family of mine watch mine. And if they do, oh well. They know I talk about her all the time. She will always get like two little shoes, but they're like high end, like two designer shoes, like two little shoes. And she will just have bunions and corns on her feet. Like that is not cute. So the red bottoms and kind of like designer shoes, they're kind of narrow sometimes. And I have like a wide foot, so I don't do corns because if your man, you know, you guys are, you know, doing your do and he want to suck them toes, he do not want to feel like he's eating corn nuts, like have a mouthful of corn nuts. So no, I'm not going to be doing that. So I tend to stay away from um, designer shoes. Also like high end shoes, like Louis, Gucci sometimes. And I do have a couple of Jordans in my collection. Um, Nikes and things like that, but very few because you guys know I love some heels and sandals. So let's get into this. I just had to let you guys know that you won't be ever seeing me buying, you know, high end shoes like that, sneakers, heels. So this is it. It comes just like this, wrapped in the plastic. So let's take it out. Ooh, look at that. Look at that right there. Isn't this cute? It didn't come lace or anything. You have to lace it yourself. I believe she said it's extra laces. Oh, yeah. Okay, so 
This is the shoe here. Sorry, guys, if I'm out of frame. This is the shoe. This is really nice. Oh, it does have the, the Nike Air sign on there. Look at that. Has the 85 there. Look at that. Vuitton. Isn't that cute? And the Nike check. So let's take a closer look. Look at that. These are really cool. And I did get a size up because I will be wearing these because I have my, what is it? Oh, it's white at the top, but I don't think it's supposed to be like this at the top right here. I think it's supposed to be like a material, but it's not. All right. So this is the back of the shoe. And this is the bottom. So it has the monogram. Love the tongue. Wide. It has the monogram on there. The monogram all along here. It has the off-white Louis Vuitton Air Jordan. The Brooklyn. The whole sign there. The whole wording. Um, this is the back. I showed you guys that. This is really, really nice. These are the um, laces. Is this leather? I believe these are leather laces, guys. I do believe. Let me smell this shoe. Mm, it doesn't have a factory smell. Okay. These are the extra laces. I'm going to take everything out. It has some stuffing. So I'm going to try to try these on so you guys can see it on my um, feet. So this is it. Let's look in the inside. That's what it looks like in the inside. I believe the only issue is here. Right here, guys. You see that? Mm, no. It's supposed to be um, fabric, I believe. This is like foam or something. You guys see it? Let me back back. So you can lace this up. You see how the um, it meets the hole? So you can lace this up like this. You can also just don't lace it all the way up to the top and just let this hang um, like that as well. So let me, yeah, I think the laces are leather. So a pair of shoes like this will run you about 4,000 and I believe they're 4,000. I do believe. So this is it. I can fix the laces or whatever, but I'm just going to try it on like she had it. Let me just tie it. Cause I'm not gonna lace these up. I'm just gonna put them on my uh, feet really quick so you guys can just see it. All right, so let's look at the other pair. So it comes like this, all protected, wrapping, let's see. The other pair is the same. And here I believe, maybe it's from how it was packaged. It has some um, lining there like some white, maybe from the um, laces there. I don't know if you guys can see that. So this is the other shoe. And then the way the holes are made, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's gonna be on your um, foot. So who's gonna be just looking down like that, but the holes there are kind of not correct, but that's okay. Same, this is the bottom. This is that. Okay, so let's see what it comes to all the paperwork. Let's see, did this have extra laces? I don't believe this one had any extra laces or maybe they're both in there. We can look at the laces in a minute. So, something like that. And this is it. Comes from the China store. Yeah, this is it. And let me just show you guys the box. This is the inside of the box. Looks like that. Really nice. All right. So let's sit the shoes on top of there. So these are it. Really nice. I like them. So let's see about these laces here. Let's see if, um, let me scoot the camera back some. Let's see if there's two laces in here. Yeah, they're in here. So she gave me, yeah, two. So you do have 
the other laces. I believe, I don't know which laces I would choose, but I might leave those on and then. So I do have this backpack here. That is the reason why I picked these shoes. So let me take the box away. Really nice. The only issue is, is here for me. I don't know about that. This is the inside like this. You see it? I don't know, guys. I don't know. All right. So let me just remove the box and put those there. So I do have... Oh my goodness, what's the name of this backpack? It's my old faithful too. This is my Mon Monsters. I don't know, guys, the name of the backpack. I will leave it um, somewhere in the video on the screen. But this is it. So the days that I dress casual, I will be wearing um, the backpack with these shoes. Let's see. So let's see about the monogram up close. Um, it's kind of off, but it doesn't bother me at all. Because this is old, guys. This is a... I took this um, backpack with me to Disneyland, and look what happened. So I was thinking about getting the all the Fashetta leather replaced, but I'm not sure about it because they tend to lose your items when you get them repaired so i'm not ready for that i love this backpack um it's patina really nicely i can throw this around and i don't i'm not sure yet but this is why i did pick these shoes because i had this backpack so the days i want to just be casual with some sweats and what so sweats in my backpack i could just throw those on and be out the door I normally wear like an eight men's, but I did size up like two because you guys know where they're coming from. So I didn't want to take any chances. They are a little bit big, but I could just double my socks or whatever and still um, get away with wearing these. So I'm going to try these on for you guys. And that is it. All right, guys, these are the sneakers. They fit comfortable. You do not have to size up. This is the front. This is the side. This is the back. And this is the other side. So they do fit real comfortable. Um, sometimes you may have to ask about the size because different shoes come in different materials. But far as this Louis Vuitton sneaker is really comfortable. And this is the bag here, just in case you guys want to see it, what it will look like. So that's that. So I am happy with um, this pair of sneakers here. I will be wearing them. I will come back with a style with me. But yeah, these are it. So I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, you already know what to do. Leave a nice, wonderful comment, and I hope everyone has a beautiful night and a wonderful tomorrow.